San Antonio wrapping up its rodeo road trip that spans all the way back to the beginning of February, February 3rd. A span of eight consecutive on the road. Friday night against the Nuggets, that was just tremendous. When I went all the way down and dunked the basketball. Paul did such a good job of harassing Murray out on the perimeter. That's right. Went right back to him. That's right. That's why you have to attack him. Because he's got to play stick man defense. <laughs> As Paul takes advantage, you see Murray there. You're absolutely right. He was straight up. He wasn't moving his feet. As Aldridge. He's taken more threes this year than any year in his career. SGA again gets down low, and that time he banks it in. No good. SGA trying to leak out on the break. Has the step, goes to the rim, and he missed it. But it looked like Forbes missed the attempt, and there is Dort elevating up to the rim for the one-handed slam as he was right there waiting for that pass. Trying to make a move. Now the Thunder got what they want with Adams in the post on White. Spins and throws it down with authority inside the block. Not just in the mid-range, even post-ups. Ball getting to where he wants. Fires it back outside. Dort, the high arcing three, and that one splashes home. And he has just played with a lot of confidence and believing he can make that shot. Ball, no. Adams right there. Weak side put back. And when the game was over, they were talking about Steven Adams. It was a quiet double-double as DeRozan again is feeling it here for the Spurs in his first quarter. As he's got six early points on three out of four shooting. Nice catch by Adams. That goes with the left hand and he flicks it up over Aldridge. Great athleticism, not just on the three-point line. Kicks it over to the corner. That three no good. By Rudy Gay. Now Dort goes right at the defense and gets the bounce in transition. Two Spurs players in his way. Not a problem. Mills left open. And cannot connect on that three. Ball loose underneath, and it's going to be an and one. As Nerlens Noel was battling there with Marcus Aldridge. Adams takes a seat. Schroeder's into the game. Fires it back out to the perimeter. As Ferguson dumps it off. Noel with the left hand. Nice finish inside. He had Rudy Gay right on his back. SGA hard drive. Takes the bump. Spins it home. And the foul. Sends it back up to Gay, who was the last one to get back down the floor. Mills already made one from behind the arc, making two. And Nolan Noel playing the two-person game. Now Schroeder wants the three straight away, and got the three straight away. It looked like Nolan Noel just swallowed up Walker on that drive. Now this is Perlo with a hard slam in the left hand. It's the screen from Nolan Noel. Now he's met by Pirtle, needs to get his dribble back, but instead it's Noel with the drive and a left-handed finish. The reason why the Thunder shot 50 percent, you brought it up, those 22 points in the paint. Gay out of the inbounds play, counted in a foul. It's a deep two. See Pirtle shedding a tear after yeah, missing that layup. I see it, it was rolling down a Pirtle's face. Are you sure it wasn't because he missed the left? <laughs> nice seal, Adams. Once he caught the pass, it was over. Yeah, absolutely. Michael, it really is. Played the Thunder tough every game this season. And San Antonio is fighting for a playoff spot in the 10 seed as Forbes cans that three. 31 points going back to the beginning of last year against Oklahoma City. Well, the Spurs bench has come in and given them a big lift. And that's going to be a big lift right there as well by Abdul Nader. And then to also incorporate that the CP swing, knowing that the defensive player has his hand on you in the, in the right sort of position is Forbes. A rare drive to the rim for him. Confidence up, keep taking those shots, putting them down. There's another quick shot this time. Gallinari rips the cords from downtown and a much needed three. As he threw Marcus Aldridge one way. Great defense by Dort, knocks away that pass, hit to hip with Forbes in transition, and he lays it up and in. What a great defensive play. I, I, I like the line that you used, but for a different possession, he had the saddle almost, right? Oh my goodness, Erlens Noel. How do you do that? SGA slings it back out to the perimeter. Gallinari, oh, what a move! And he slips by Aldridge for the reverse slam. Officially, Vitamins in his socks. And now Dort picks the pocket of DeRozan in the post. Good job picking up that loose change with Dort Gallinari. Trying to cap it off with a three, and he does! Now Aldridge in the post. We haven't seen San Antonio run this play. This has been a bread and butter Spurs play. 
and that's going to count. That'll be an and one. This has been a bread and butter Spurs play for the last two years. And that's not San Antonio's offense. If you got them taking that early in the shot clock, coming off a screen by White, you can live with that. And look what it's leading to on the other end. From Chris Paul, defense has been on point here for the Thunder in this second quarter. Gay with the steal, comes right back and sheds Gallinari for the slam. Now five, under five. Paul floats. Adams, second effort, no, third effort. Yes, as he finally stuck with it. The all-star dunk contest. That's my dunk champion. That's right, I said it, Aaron Gordon. One of the biggest heists ever. Boy, SGA had that exact same play in the second quarter. Around LaMarcus Aldridge to get that steal. Not only he poke it away, but he beat him to the basketball. Now Adams off that beautiful slip pass inside from CP. The whole arena heard that. That's right, that's right. Paul and Adams gonna run the same play. This time Paul pops back and drills the mid-range. As he has really played about as well as anybody here tonight. And how about Lou Dort, who's playing better than everybody tonight. Chris Paul already with seven assists. Slip pass and Pirtle able to get the step on Steven Adams and convert. On that play by the Thunder to get out to Mills after doubling up Pirtle on the box. SGA sets it up in Nerlens Noel and all kinds of traffic throws it down hard. But that energy and that effort has been there again. Dort passed up the three for a better shot. It's Gallinari and he takes advantage and knocks it down. And you see Gallinari giving a point over to Dort as they both get back on the floor defensively. As NBA is going to become front and center. And the Thunder in position to make another playoff push as DeRozan able to sidestep his way up to the rim. I think he got it though. I think he got it. Nader, run off the line, wants to drive, hangs in the air long enough despite the presence of Aldridge. Lower back issue, so Diallo getting the minutes here, hasn't played a couple of games. Chasing Nelly Nelly, who probably drills that top of the key jumper. Keep it going for Oklahoma City, but not on that particular possession. And really, Michael, what's been the key? Because it's been on both ends of the floor as we get a left-handed layup there by Johnson. Every time you come to the arena, you get treated as a fan. Well, and they've done a great job of making themselves, you know, really fun to watch. As Adams, just speaking of fun, <laughs> absolutely. Job that he's done in bringing everybody together, getting them all to buy into the unselfish play that has led to this Thunder team and the success that it's had. All five guys connected. You know, they're, they're good friends. They're having fun. I, I think and this is what I'm talking about. That is some serious levitation from the 2019 slam dunk champ, Hamadou Diallo. And, you know, once again, the Thunder get back-to-back -back games with all five starters in double figures. Potentially, there could be a team under 500 in the Western Conference making the playoffs. Theoretically, it's Chemezi Metu, former USC player with the slam there. Tonight, always those eight games they play. Well, another player into double digits. There is Nerlens Noel. He's got 10 scored double digits in OKC history. Metu again getting to his spot. Nice jumper. So despite his size, showing off that shooting touch. Doesn't matter what the score is. And how about Muscala? He'll get into the box score. Energy was, 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 you know, it just, it was felt throughout the team. As Metu will put that one down with two hands. And one, two in a row. Speaking of two in a row, there's Bellinelli. Oh my God. The thing about this Thunder team is it continues to get better and better. As that'll be the final shot of this one. As Nader will control. And officially in the books is a Thunder W. Now 13 games over 500.